Welcome to another Junk Fooding Friday on R&DW Adventures. I'm Daryl. And I'm Renee. And today we have some Ramune that we ran into at H Mart, our local Asian. A Asian box store. And these really took me by surprise because they're aluminum cans, or aluminum bottles of Ramune. With no... So there's no uh, marble seal like we enjoy, but I love the aluminum bottles. Yes. I don't like aluminum cans so much, no, but I but love gosh. the aluminum bottles. You know, aluminum is great because it cools down so easily in the fridge. Mm -hmm. And this just seemed like a good combination. It's fun. So we ended up with the original flavor, white peach and grape. So we don't have a lot of hope for the grape. We'll do that one last. Okay. I don't like grape usually. It tastes like medicine. Yeah. The uh, original. Hata Original is our first one. <laughs> I didn't expect that. Smells like bubble gum. It kind of does. <laughs> oh, that's a. As fizzy as it I is. I don't understand this bottle. Yeah, I'm not sure it's actually uh, like a full aluminum bottle. I think it is, but. It's a weird texture. I'm not sure how I feel about this. I like it. I don't know that I taste a difference between this and the other original Ramunes. No, I just like so, the marble in the glass. Yeah. Ramune. But. No, but I think it tastes about the same. I like it. Yeah, I like it. One of the things I like about the Ramune is it tends to not be as sweet as American soda. Right. So for carbonated drinks, it's but definitely... I, I'm still not such a fan of the carbonation. I like the bubbliness of it, but yeah. not something I want to drink. So I'm going to give it a three still. I'm going to give it a three as well. I'm still baffled by the bottle. Yeah, the bottle is weird. Because it's... Well, like this, it's not... Once it opens, it's like pliable. Not pliable, Yeah, well, I think it's just because it's such a big, flat surface. You know, kind of like a... Uh, kind of like when you go to the eye doctor right now. You know uh, what's but this coming? one, oops, this you know, one is the uh, white, peach. white peach. You know, no, it's I'm about not sure we can show it. Yeah. Oh, that one didn't do it as much. The other one went poof. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's nasty. Tastes like warm, flat. Medicine. And it's not warm, it's cold. Yeah, it's, but it's, I don't like it at all. I actually kind of like it. I'm giving it a one. I'm not a peach person and I kind of like it. So maybe that says something. I am I'm, a peach person. I think it's, yeah, I'm not giving good. it a three. Okay. Yeah. I'm. All right, so the last one. I'll probably love it. No. <laughs> is the grape. <laughs> Which we all know Renee likes real grapes, hates grape things. Right. I call them purple flavored things. So it's only good if it pops and scares you. Ooh. It, it smells like a... It, it smells like a uh, grape uh, cough syrup. Mm -hmm. Diamond. Like the whole room yeah. now smells like grape cough syrup. Hmm. It's not as bad as I would have expected. Yes, it is. That's going to get a one and a half for me. Still getting a one. Oof. But the bottle's so weird. I want, kind of want to rinse out the bottles and keep using them. <laughs> Maybe just the bubblegum tasting one. All right. That is going to wrap up this video, though. If you like our weird, uh, ill-advised taste tests, make sure to check out the playlist over here for more of our junk fooding videos, because we do have hundreds of them over there. Our uh, channel icon is over there, and we have other stuff on the channel aside from the junk fooding, including some openings, some geocaching, some travel, and that kind of stuff. So mm -hmm. make sure to check out the other videos that we have.